drink today because I try drinks every Friday that I saw on Pinterest. I want to see if they taste good and I do it and I tell you if they are good or not. Now a couple weeks ago I expressed some inner turmoil, some uncertainty. Should we continue with this weekly drinking series or has it lived its life? I feel like I've tried everything. Um, but some of you really let me know that you do like to drink every Friday and uh, you gave me some suggestions. So I'm gonna start trying some of your suggestions that I'm also seeing on Pinterest and we'll see how they go. This week we're gonna try a drink called the Northern Lights. It was actually recommended by two of you, Samantha Bird and Minnie Moore. You both wanted me to try the Northern Lights and funny thing, I had actually pinned this. I looked on my Pinterest board and it's there. So three people, myself included, thought I should try this drink and it sure is pretty. So we're gonna try it. I traced this drink back to the tipsybartender.com. He's also huge on YouTube and he usually has very beautiful models making drinks drinks with him in his kitchen. I think his drinks look very delicious. Um, so we're gonna make that drink today. Thank you, tipsy bartender. I wish I had some beautiful models. Wait a second. Nope. To make this drink, you're going to add a shot of deep eddy lemon vodka. Isn't that beautiful? I feel like we can just add ice and a straw and call it a day. And heck, maybe someday that's exactly what we'll do. But today we're adding it to our drink. You also need to add an ounce of Smirnoff Sours Berry Lemon Vodka. I really wanted to buy that because it looks so fun, uh, but I didn't, I, I di didn't even try. For now, we're gonna add strawberry vodka to our Northern Lights cocktail. That's a lot of vodka. <laughs> I think I need a bigger glass. Still a lot of vodka. <laughs> Squeeze in some lemon juice and then top it off with a Red Bull Blueberry. I don't have Red Bull Blueberry. I have a leftover Monster Energy Ultra Blue. Same thing, different can. Garnish with lemons and blueberry and what you have is a beautiful Northern Lights bright ultra blue slash purple drink if it looks like the picture. I have to say right off, I'm feeling a little bit disappointed because this does not look anything like the Northern Lights drink in the picture. And I feel like it might be because I didn't use the Smirnoff Sours. I just knew that would happen. When I stray from the original recipe, things go haywire and I end up with a foggy looking light blue drink instead of Northern Lights. <sighs> Let's see how it tastes. Really strong, <laughs> but really good. This is fantastic. This is really, you know, I, I started off feeling disappointed, but the drink has redeemed itself completely. I would say that you probably, regular people probably only need one shot of one type of vodka. You probably don't need two shots of two types of vodka, um, but, I'm not complaining, it's, it's fine. This is the kind of drink you make for your sisters and you say, girls, get over here. I've got just the drink for you. I, we need some girl time and I need a drink. I kind of can't believe how drinkable this is considering like it was vodka up to here. But it's drinkable, I'll tell you what, this is really good. I'm definitely gonna recommend the Northern Lights cocktail. This is a good one. And if you can splurge and go get that Smirnoff Sours Berry Lemon bottle, Maybe that would make it look more impressive. If you don't care about it looking impressive, then just use what you have on hand. I think that this is the thing that made it real tasty. Uh, maybe also this. So lemon vodka, blue energy drink. There you go. Garnish, have a great weekend with that. And thank you for your suggestions. You really, I feel like it was a really a team effort and we knocked it out of the park. So Northern Lights for me, to you. Cheers! You deserve it, baby. You deserve it all. And I'm gonna give it to you. Gold jewelry shining so bright. Strawberry champagne on us. Lucky for you, that's what I like. That's what I like. Lucky for you, that's what I like. That's what I like.